new year fresh start new series officially trip talk tuesday happy new year everybody it's 2017 it's still it's gonna take me it's gonna take me a little while to get used to saying that and writing it down. Do you always like write the last year when it's in January and stuff? I do. This is gonna be a new series for 2017. I did touch on them a few times last year, but my aim for last year was to get as many What We've Done Wednesdays out, and I succeeded. I'm quite proud with how many I got out there. I think including Vlogmas, which I hope you've been watching, it's, it's slightly different take on Vlogmas to some to the other YouTubers out there, but it's our take and I hope it's given you something to watch through that horrible limbo time of year the, the time between Christmas and New Year and you don't know what day it is and you don't really know what to eat and you're sick of chocolate this is the start of our Trip Talk Tuesday series now again you will probably recognize it I have done it and I did do it and the build up to our last trip but I'm wanting to continue it a little bit more and that is my aim for 2017 to do a few more of these we get a lot of people commenting messages um, tweeting everything asking us questions on a whole range of things um, from the cruise to wedding to traveling with kids to recommendations for things I want to get all them in a video. Every single time someone messages me and asks me a question, I think, I need to do a video on that. I need to do a video on that. And I feel, I feel like it's probably going to be so beneficial to you, but I just need to get it all in a video. Um, I can't promise that it's going to be one a week. It's probably going to be like one a month, maybe, or something like that. Maybe two, depending on how much you want from us, really. If you guys have got any questions that you want to ask of us to include in our Trip Talk Tuesday series, then please feel free to comment, message me, anything. Uh, just get in touch and tell me what you want to see. I mean, we've done the Wishes Cruise before, which was amazing on the Grand One Yacht, as you'll have seen in our previous videos. Um... We got married out there. We've taken two Disney cruises, one a three-nighter, one a four-nighter. Um, we have been with children. We have been without children. We have been with babies. We have been with toddlers. We have been with young children. There's a lot. I am quite proud with what we have experienced and what we can say we can be experienced um, and what I feel I can offer you guys in guidance from our experiences. So... Again, if there's anything that you want to see, you want to hear, then please feel free to just get in touch. A lot of these Trip Talk Tuesday videos may be in relation to children, um, because I know there's a lot of you out there travelling to Walt Disney World with kids. That falls nicely into why I'm here today. Um, today is going to be a review on the Kingdom Strollers rental company we've rented strollers with them twice in the past um, our first trip harper was 10 months old so she was very much a baby uh, we rented a city mini double zach was around i think he just 10 4 if i remember right yeah he just 10 4 the month before he'd not been in a stroller for probably a good 18 months maybe two years something like that however we knew that going out there being as busy as we was going to be and as 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 non-stop as it was going to be that we needed something for both children to be comfy and to be relaxed and as a fallback particularly for zach as a fallback for when he gets tired and um, when he wants to sit down at it was too hot for Alex to, or, or myself to carry Zach around, like here, there and everywhere. It, it would have just been unbearable for everybody. We would have got stressed. The kids would have got stressed. I'd seen Kingdom Strollers before actually driving around the Walt Disney World area. And little did I know at that time, because that was prior to us having children and we had no knowledge of, of what it would be like traveling with kids at all. They are a preferred supplier to Walt Disney World in the stroller rental industry. Um, now that is amazing. That would be something I have no doubt at all that they are so, so proud of because it is a, a fantastic fantastic achievement it's 
you, you don't get don't get much better than that does it that is amazing so i had seen their vans previously that was one of the reasons why i ended up going with them but i'd also seen a good couple of reviews from them too so the our first trip as i say we got a city mini double perfect for harper again she was only 10 months old she wasn't walking um she was well, she actually started walking when we got back which is typical but it was perfect size for her. The pram was perfect for both of them, honestly. Uh, that is a beast. And they look so cute in it. Are they being in it? Yeah, we've had to sort out all the straps and stuff. Where do you are? Down You're on the front of that. Downstairs. It's so funny because they look like. What should I say then? Considering they're so little and they're so far apart, they both fit perfectly in it. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, right. Considering she's not even one and needs like four. Right. The stroller came with drinks holders, it came with rain cover, it had storage underneath, it had storage on the back of the chair, the chairs could recline. Um, it was so comfortable, I, I wasn't sat in it, but I was very, very, very tempted to sit in it at one point because it just looked so comfortable. It was easy to push. I will admit to when I first saw it, I thought, oh my goodness, how on earth are we gonna get this through the doors, through the shops? this is going to be a nightmare but honestly it was an absolute breeze they're very equipped for all that they're very equipped with the doors they have wheelchairs going in and out of walt disney world day in day out throughout the shop they are very very prepared so do not be worried about that this past trip we rented again with kingdom strollers this time we rented a bob revolution i think it might be called um, and that was a beast. We thought the city mini double was big. Oh, we ended up calling this one the Hulk. It was green and we called it the Hulk. It was humongous. Now, again, I was worried last time. I was worried again that we weren't going to be able to fit through doors or we weren't being able to fit through shops. We weren't even going to be able to fit it in the car. But we, got, we did. No issues at all. This one, although it was bigger than the previous one, was 100% easier to push um it was unbelievably light honestly i cannot i still cannot believe it now that that big massive monster of a of a push chair was as easy as it was to push you could literally push it with one finger honestly it was so so easy it was a breeze the bob you could also remove your wheels i'm not 100% sure if you could remove the wheels on the city mini um but you could 100% remove the wheels. If you had a smaller car, both of them fit in the car perfectly. Um, we hired a Chrysler 300. No issues there getting them in the boot whatsoever. If there was, and if you did, again, you could take the wheels off the BOB. The BOB also had a uh, rain cover. It had drinks holder. It didn't have as much storage, I felt, as the City Mini. I had enough. There was no, like, no i didn't have no issues with trying to put anything underneath or anything like that i just think if i remember rightly the city mini had um like storage on the back of the kids chairs where this one didn't both of them easily reclined you just pull the strings on the back of it and undid the sides on the bob the kids could 100 percent just be wheeled up to the curb side um instead of having to sit on the floor and waiting for a parade or firework they could sit in the pram whilst they were eating a snack or whilst we were needing to be somewhere um if we needed to be somewhere quick they would just both jump in and we would be off i cannot recommend if you have small children particularly under the age of six to rent a stroller honestly and if you have two then rent a double one one you will not regret it it will be the best money that of, of the probably the whole trip that you will have spent i guarantee now disney do have their own um but having looked at them having seen the prices um they don't compare to them they do they do not compare to kingdom strollers whatsoever at all they're not even close now i understand that if you have older children, the, D the Disney ones would probably be more beneficial because once you get to a certain weight or, or height, then yeah, Kingdom Strollers may not have a big enough um, push chair for you. But if they do, don't go with it. Honestly, there's only one place you should be going and that's Kingdom Strollers. The you don't need to hire or waste your money 
with the Disney ones. They are so uncomfortable. They they're just they are solid, solid plastic. I'm not I'm not dissing the Disney strollers too much because I know for some they are the only option, such as taller children or heavier children or older children, things like that. Um, but if you can fit in a kingdom stroller please get a kingdom stroller you will not regret it at all the kids will be happy you will be happy the kids will be comfy you will be comfy you won't have this big massive bag on your back because you can just shove it in the pram when they're not sat on it when these two get too big i am gonna be so gutted when we can't hire a stroller i really 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 am i cannot recommend kingdom strollers enough i honestly can't oh, we pay for both our stroller rentals we didn't get anything for free um or anything like that we paid for it out of our own pocket they're helpful their prices are very competitive the push chairs are immaculate honestly you would not think that anybody had been in that push chair um, before you it's like walking into a shop buying a brand new push chair it is ridiculous how clean how tidy that they can get like i know how grubby my push chair gets they just must they're just amazing they're honestly amazing they're in full working order um and they have a really good relationship with disney as i've said they deliver locally you might just want to check out their website to see specifically where they do deliver they will deliver it to your your property whether it be your villa whether it be your hotel lobby or a condo or something like that first time we went we got it delivered to the villa which was just in highgrove claremont um this last time they delivered it to the lobby in all star sports they have a good rapport with the disney um team members and cast members Disney very kindly showed us how to put up the pram this trip, um, which I thought was very helpful. Although the pushchair is left, there are instructions as to how to put up the pram, how to fold down the pram. It's, it, it's yeah, they are very, very good at what they do. As you'll have already seen in the title, um, I'm sure you've all been waiting for this little announcement. But we've teamed up with Kingdom Strollers to give you, one of you... A free stroller rental on your next vacation how awesome is that they are so you you are so lucky so kingdom strollers have given us to give to you you we had to pay given you a free stroller rental for up to 10 days okay there's just a few little things that you have to do for me if that's all right but you know how much i love getting value for money um and sharing my bargains and sharing my must-haves with you so i feel that this was something that i needed to do for you guys um as a thank you for watching our videos and to give you an opportunity to experience what we've experienced and, and to ease the stress of traveling with children um to give your kids comfort um and keep them happy if you're happy then they're happy right so i am extremely happy to be able to share with you this amazing giveaway courtesy of kingdom strollers now all you have to do to enter is make sure that you subscribe to this channel i will be doing a video to announce the winner um so if you subscribe and you just ring that little bell up there you will automatically get notification of when i upload that video to see if you're a winner of course and comment down below let me know what you want to see more of from our channel um i hope you've enjoyed this video this is the kind of thing that i'm wanting to do and bring to you um in the hope that it helps you um plan your trip there are also other ways to enter into this giveaway you will you can potentially have four entries into this giveaway i think it might be five in fact the youtube one you can follow my blog and comment on the blog post on my blog page links to everything mentioned will be all down below in the description box for a third entry you can go to our facebook page you can comment on the kingdom strollers picture that i put up there you can also if you want and i think it's just right that you go on head over to kingdom strollers and give them a little like because again this is such a generous prize for somebody to win even if you don't win it just acknowledge them and say thank you they don't have to do this um, it's a very 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 kind gesture that they have done for us um so yeah again feel free to pop on over there for a fourth entry head on over to twitter and again 
retweet our Kingdom Strollers picture giveaway. And a fifth entry you can get, it is five, I thought it was just four, it's five. You can heart our Instagram photo. Again, the Kingdom Strollers giveaway picture. Five, you have five chances of winning this if I do all of those social media things. That's quite cool, isn't it? That is, I still can't believe that they have been so generous. You can get a stroller rental for your trip and your trip had, does have to be within 2017. Um, because it's likely that you'll have probably already planned that and you'll have it booked and things. There's very little point in saying it's to go beyond there because it's likely you're probably not booked for 2018 just yet and you may be just working on days. So this is just for trips within 2017 by the, obviously the end of this year. Get liking, get commenting, just do it. Honestly, it's such an amazing prize. I am so proud to say that we have teamed up with Kingdom Shoulders. They are, we would go with nobody else and I recommend them to you guys as well. As I mentioned briefly earlier in the video, please just also head on over to their Facebook page just to see where they do deliver their strollers. I would hate for you to win and then find out that they don't actually deliver the stroller to where you are staying. So please just go check out the proximity of where they actually deliver the strollers to to make sure where you are staying is where they deliver. I would hate for you to be disappointed in that. Also, if you have any questions that you want to ask of them they have a whole full list of frequently asked questions you can see all the strollers that are available on there and you can also see some few other little things which i thought was amazing they also hire out little cots bedding and also disabled push chairs which i think is fantastic be sure to go check them out and make sure you let them know that we've sent you thank you again for watching Feel free to give the video a thumbs up and don't forget to comment if you want to be entered into this prize draw. We'll see you next time. Bye.